Hey, what's up guys? Tommy West here back with another episode of my NBA 2K20 My Team Budget Series Hard Cap episode number 94 and look at that on the screen. You see it right there. It is finally here. We finally made it and it's not all time spotlight sims. It's final spotlight sims. Uh, five categories, 10 games, 50 games in total. Uh, as I had been saying, I had built up my my uh, troops. I was ready. I had 10 players from every team and some not too bad players. Uh, we're going to go through and look at some guys that I would picked up for this uh, who we can uh, might wind up having to just sell. Uh, we did pick up the Diamond Terrence Ross only because uh, we do have the pink Diamond Terrence Ross, but this one uh, plays for the Toronto Raptors, so uh, we could have theoretically used him in a Raptors team. Uh, we picked up the Miami Heat LeBron James. We got him for about 34k, and looks like uh, let's see, uh, there, there aren't any cheaper than that at the moment. Uh, nothing in the lights out. I don't think we added any moments of the week cards. Maybe that Hassan Whiteside for a Portland team. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Uh, only three legacy cards, so nothing there. Uh, we did add that Joe Dumars. We picked him up for like 8k. Uh, we got some really good deals on some of these cards that we added. Uh, let's throw a contract on him. I hate to see that out of contract uh, banner across our cards. Um, nothing there. Oh, we picked up uh, Pink Diamond Allen Iverson for, I want to say it was 15k uh, to run in our 76ers lineup. Uh, nothing here, but we have looked several times, looked very hard at Giannis glitch Giannis we picked up that Oscar Robertson uh, I got the pink diamond DeMar DeRozan and the pink diamond Rajon Rondo uh, I got this DeRozan because I wanted to try him out uh, kind of uh, to see if I wanted his Galaxy Opal so yeah I just wanted to try him out uh, nothing not, looks like nothing new here uh, we did try to sell that Vince Carter a few times, but we never did. Uh, Prime VIP. Oh, just last night I bought the Lakers Shaquille O'Neal pink diamond. Uh, I think we paid 35k for him, which was a, a pretty good deal. Uh, nothing else new here. Um, nothing there. Uh, nothing nothing here nothing there oh buzzer beaters we got a couple of these uh, Chris Webber we got him for about 15k and Pete Maravich also I think we paid 14 and a half K Avery Bradley was something like 8k if I'm not mistaken uh, yeah so some pretty cheap cards uh, all things considered uh, no new campus legends guys uh, there are plenty of spotlight sim cards to talk about uh, no new fan favorites the prime VIP series 2 this was the new content drop and George Gervin and Gary Payton were both buyouts on the first day so we picked them up uh, I think Gervin we we only paid like 45k for him and Gary Payton was a little bit more, I want to say he was like 60k and uh, the pink diamond David Robinson also a phenomenal card he was pretty cheap though uh, I want to say we got him for like I remember it wasn't more than the than it cost to buy a pack I remember that so it had to be like 7 or 8k uh, low key a snipe on the pink diamond David Robinson uh, 
he's very close to his opal from what I hear and uh, Tony Parker Diamond Tony Parker another one we picked up and he was only something like 2400 MT so yeah he's not uh, was not too bad on the old pocketbook and you take a look at his attributes and 23 Hall of Fames and 50 Golds uh, we're at the point in the year where every card is uh, is super OP they all have 55 plus badges they all have 90 plus in every stat uh, now it's really just to a point of who has the better releases, who has the better tendencies, and uh, who has the best animations. Uh, nothing new here. We did pick up a Luau Dang Pink Diamond from the Flash 6 set to, uh, to beef up our Miami Heat front court. Uh, we sold our Spud Web because I did pick up... Uh, the moments pink diamond Trey Young not the there's two of them one was like a 97 one was like 98 one was like 50k and one was like 24k we got the one that was 24k uh, so yeah we sold spud web now the throwback moments we had Eddie Jones last time we talked we had Wilson Chandler and Daquan Cook uh, since then we picked up Kyle Lowry because he was going for like 45k at one point uh, I don't see him quite that cheap now there's one for 47 so it's probably not too many uh, not many too far off of that uh, we also got a Opal Steve Nash released uh, we did not buy him uh, I think we have I think we have the pink diamond Steve Nash or, I don't know maybe we don't but uh, this Opal was not a uh, did not appeal to me. I did look long and hard at this Opal Gordon Hayward. Uh, you see he's still going for over 100k. But uh, he had a diamond card earlier in the year that I really enjoyed the release. Uh, that card's jumper. So uh, this one's probably nice. There's also an Opal Robert Parrish that we didn't pick up. He's a buyout. Uh, I don't think he has a uh, range or much of a three-point shot but this card right here guys this uh, Jeff Teague looks phenomenal absolutely phenomenal so yeah we had picked up uh, pink diamond Trey Young for our Atlanta Hawks team and then this card got released and it he was super cheap and we picked him up so uh, we did go ahead and sell our out of position spud web but look at this the badges on this card the stats on this card uh, have not really used him a whole lot yet but he looks amazing and we can't have a respectable 90's Bulls team without the saucy Aussie Luke Longley uh, this card is does not look uh, really that good but again I can't call myself a respectable uh, Chicago Bulls fan without picking up uh, Luke Longley 24 Hall of Fame so 10 golds not bad for a diamond and now we will go and look because uh, it wasn't too long ago I showed you guys all the spotlight sim cards we picked up. We did add a few more and one really special one. The Galaxy Opal Steven Jackson. I've heard so many great things about this card. 6'8", 230, can play the shooting yard position. Uh, 96 driving layup, 92 three-point shot, 95 driving dunk. Uh, great, great stats all the way down. 93 speed, 90 speed with ball, 94 acceleration, 91 lateral quickness. And uh, let's look at uh, 42 Hall of Fames, 10 gold badges. Uh, again, he's got all the great Hall of Fame badges that you need. 
and he's got the good Hall of Fame badges that you'll want. I can't believe he's only got gold defensive leader. That should definitely be Hall of Fame. Let's look at his tendencies. Uh, let's see. On ball still 64. Shot contest 70. Uh, block shot 58. Pass interception 68. So yeah, these aren't great either. But uh, Captain Jack uh, we only paid, he was, he was like 65k. All these cars got super cheap. Bob Sura, Pink Diamond, I hear great things about. And this card was only 12k? Something like it. We picked up Tyler Hero when his price dipped to about 20k. Uh, since the packs are gone, looks like he's gone up a little bit. No, there's still some under... There's one under 20k, so yeah. Uh, we added Jordan Pool. He was super cheap, 3,500. I want to say OG Ananobi also about 3k MT. Uh, Nicholas Claxton also uh, we picked him up for like 28, 2800. And I thought long and hard about getting this Saronis Marcellonis because this one of the cheapest opals out there and he he play he can't play point guard for the Golden State Warriors which is a team that I thought I needed a backup point guard for but hey spoiler alert guys this was all for naught we don't need any there are no uh, lineup restrictions for any of the finals uh, spotlight sims uh, but just to show you also uh, there was a moment where I was uh, stuck between getting LaMarcus Aldridge and Kevin Willis. We did wind up getting them both. So uh, they're, they're kind of samey. Uh, we, got, we also got Bingo Smith off of a triple threat board uh, last weekend when they were doing the triple threat mystery packs and uh, putting all the rewards cards back up on boards. I showed you, we got a lot of those rewards cards. But we did. We got Bingo Smith after the fact. Uh, we also got. There was one more. Uh, Gus Williams, I showed you guys. Spencer Haywood. Yeah, we, we got him also on our triple threat board last weekend. And he does not have range extender. But other than that, this car looks really good. Uh, 97 driving layup, 84 three-point shot. You'd like that to be a little bit higher, but 94 mid-range, 98 close, uh, 95 driving dunk, 97 the standing dunk. He's got good passing, ball handling, 92 block, 85 steal, 94 on the perimeter and interior on D, 98 rebounding, 95 speed, 90 speed with ball, 95 acceleration, 94 lateral quickness, 42 Hall of Fames, 14 Golds, and yeah, this is just a really class uh, card right here. Again, I don't think, let's just make sure, yeah, no range extender at all on this card. But other than that, the card looks phenomenal. And Nate Archibald, I think we, I think we went over him last episode pretty sure yeah last episode we got Gus and we got Nate and we got Marcus Campy uh, since then again we got Spencer Haywood Hayward Haywood Haywood and Bingo Smith which would have been great again if uh, we needed to put together <laughs> lineups for every team but again we don't need every team and we don't need uh, any lineup uh, restrictions so we're gonna play our first game and we're just gonna run with this team which is taco bowl bowl cam reddish kobe and wes off the bench eddie curry hakeem pascal eddie jones hito and then james harden george gervin and david robinson so we'll take a look at gervin and robinson uh, for the first time and uh, another look at eddie jones and kobe but yeah, this is what we wound up with. Five final Spotlight Sims. Broke, 
broken up into decades. For each decade, 10 games against uh, the champion from each year. Uh, each set you get a pink diamond reward and a galaxy opal reward uh, along with uh, MT and tokens and things. For the 70s you get a pink diamond Willis Reed and a galaxy opal Dennis Johnson. For the 80s you get a pink diamond Michael Cooper and a galaxy opal Kevin McHale. For the 90s you get a pink diamond Horace Grant and a galaxy opal Dennis Rodman. For the 2000s, you get a pink diamond Bruce Bowen and a galaxy oval Paul Pierce. And for the 2010s, you get a pink diamond Shane Battier and a galaxy oval Marcus All. And yeah, this is it. No uh, restrictions for each game. You can run any old lineup you want. So what I've been up to the past few weeks of uh, trying to get the best cards to make the best lineup for each team, uh, it was all... It was all just a waste of time, but uh, I've got a lot of cards I can sell now. A lot of cards I'm not going to be needing. Um, let's get into our first game. We're just going to start in the 70s and work our way up. Uh, we're going to make some changes. On ball pressure to smother, off ball pressure to tight. Uh, let's force direction baseline. Uh, on ball screen, on all my screens I want to go over uh, all the hedges, I want hard hedges, we'll go over, we'll hard hedge, uh, stay attached, we'll leave that on automatic, off ball screen, uh, go over, and uh, da, 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 yeah. I reckon that's good. Offensive settings. Uh, we'll put in our play, and we're running the Houston Rockets playbook as always. I don't know if I'll use it, any of these, but just in case we need them. Fist one point trip, fist two high. Uh, we'll use our five out, ISO five out and uh, quick veer fist is a nice play for three point shots we'll put our freelance uh, to the Hawks 2018 and to point in case we want to try some rim running An old deep hash rim run that I still don't really know what what's the point of that but anyway that's how you do that's what you need to do it and we'll turn our help defense off and yeah let's let's get it let's get into it and all these games are all exactly the same they're all five minute quarters they're all superstar difficulty so uh, I don't know how hard these are gonna be but uh, we may not even really need our uh, our Nets playbook for these uh, sims, but we'll see. All right, so we call our Hawks freelance. We go to pass and screen away, and we wind up with a five out. Uh, Cam will come around. And he'll get open and he'll knock down a three. Cam Reddish still an elite card in this game. And we're running bowl bowl because we still need some assists with him. So we make the pass and Kobe Bryant makes the shot. And Kobe with the steal. Kobe with the short J. And that falls and Kobe's got four early points. Bowl to Kobe for the slam. And we're up early. Uh, they make a little comeback. Taco with the fadeaway. No good, but Kobe with the putback and the jam. Oh my god, Kobe. Don't do him like that. The other end. Dick Bennett greens the shot. Wes unselled. He stops. He pops. He shut him down. Open up shop. Ho ho, no ho, 
That's how trash weasels roll. Good defense by Bobo inside. Good defense again by Bobo with a second block. Shut him down. Taco with a blocko. And Wes with the steal. Ahead to Bowl. Back to Wes with the two handed jam. And uh, I was starting to say we're going to run away with this, but they come right back. It's only a three point game. Hito's in. We got our reserves in. Hito's pulling the trigger, and he's greening. And uh, we're up by six. George Gervin for three. No good. But David Robinson, the Admiral. We never got his Galaxy Opal. But finally, we have a good David Robinson card to run with. Hito again pulling up the three. That's good. We we'll go up by eight. And they want to talk it over. Hito again dropping the three on him. And we're up by 11. Uh, Eddie Jones for three off the catch 12 point lead Hito to George Gervin George Gervin with the green three and everybody's dropping bombs on him James Harden he gets in there he drops a bomb on him and we're starting to run away with this Harden to Kobe 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 has 11. Iggy B's no, his jumper's no good. The putback's no good. Pascal ahead to Kobe. Kobe all the way. Kobe being Bryant. Yeah, if you didn't get that goat card, it is well worth the grind. I mean, that grind is retarded. But it is well worth it. This Kobe card is next level. Uh, you see there, we do get the win. It's a 20, 26 point victory. So uh, no, no difficulties at all running with uh, our God squad. And uh, Kobe had 16. Hito had 12. Hito was perfect from the floor. Eddie Jones had 10 points and 2 steals, so not bad for him. Hakeem Olajuwon, we didn't see any highlights, but he had 6 points, 8 boards, and 4 blocks. And that Hakeem card is also well worth the grind. Uh, West did his thing, 5 points, 3 boards, and 2 steals. George Gervin, not too bad. Uh, 5 points, a rebound, a block. Cam Reddish only hit one shot and it was a three. Taco only hit one shot and it was a three. But he had five boards and two blocks. Eddie Curry, Pascal, James Harden all had three points. And Bo Bo had six assists for us. Still working on his Evo. We'll get there one day, Bo. One day. So, oh yeah, I don't even think I mentioned it. But yeah, you're going to do all these uh, final spotlight sims for the uh, five pink diamonds and five galaxy opals that I mentioned. And when you're done with all that, you're going to lock in for a goat Larry Bird galaxy opal. Uh, we did make some sales in the auction house, a big one in the uh, form of Glenn Rice. Uh, a lot of little ones. A lot of guys were just sitting in our auction. I was waiting to see what these uh, what these final sims were going to be like. If you were going to need certain teams or certain cards. So I just sat on everything that I had. Uh, you know, I didn't want to undercut myself. But there you have it. Uh, final spotlight sims. You don't need any uh any kind any specific player you can run any old team through there and uh yeah that's uh that's pretty much where we're at right now so i don't know what i'm gonna do with uh because i do have a lot of players that i absolutely don't need now 
I may just for the fun of it, just for shits and giggles, because there's 50 games you have to play. Well, 49 now. We finished one. So 49 games we have to play. I may run, uh, may run those lineups anyway. I may just do, uh, the best, uh, best lineup for each team. And, uh, and then, uh, go through it that way. But, uh, uh, obviously we're going to sell off a lot of these cars as we get through with this stuff uh, we are at just under or just over 280,000 MT right now and I really would like to push that up over three about 330 I think will be enough for us to go ahead and pick up the glitched Giannis and the addition of a point guard Giannis along with the addition of a Galaxy Opal Larry Bird will have us just about where we want to be uh, team wise I mean we have a great team right now I feel like uh, if I was able to play online we would we would fare pretty well with that team that we just ran uh, I do feel like small forward is still uh, one of our weakest positions, but uh, Larry Bird can fix that. New locker code is finals dash spotlight dash sim, and I have no idea what's up here. Okay, looks like uh, pink diamond Iggy, diamond Kevin Durant, diamond Steph Curry, and amethyst uh, Kawhi Leonard, and a pack. You know, I wouldn't mind having that pink diamond Andre Iguodala. So we're going to drop right there and nod. Oh, dag nabbit. Oh, what is that? The Kawhi? Yeah, that's the Kawhi. Okay, so we didn't fish what we wanted. But we can search for him. And this old trick, uh, when a guy's in a locker code, you know he's not going to be much. Now this Iggy was going for about 25k. And there's one for 99.50. We'll take it. We'll take that all day. Yeah, the only thing. And, oh, and we had a Nets playbook that we got out of a out of a pack, and uh, we'll sell him for. We got almost 8k for it. Yeah, I don't really think you're gonna need Nets playbooks for this. If you got a good team, you should be fine. But uh, we're gonna grind. But that's it for this episode. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I love you guys. And I'll see you next time. And never die.